Hey everyone, it's Joe and Isaiah here from The Automator, and today we're talking about the Auto Hockey Tune-Up. This is a program we put together with a lot, incredible amount of value as far as I'm concerned. Mm -hmm. So we were just going to talk through a bit about what you get with it. One of the really cool things is, you know, this tune-up is basically where you come to us with a script either you have written or one that you're using, and you bring it to us, and we help you think of ways to improve it or think of different approaches on it. And it's one of the most valuable parts of it is, when it's your code, something you're familiar with, it's so much easier to understand and to learn a new concept as opposed to some arbitrary code you find a forum post or something. We usually go ahead and uh, try to teach and usually use examples that I am familiar with, but that usually right. does not translate well to other people like, hey, uh, how do I get that, what I just learned and put it into my code? So the idea is that if you bring your code here, we go ahead and check and comment on it. And usually it's a little bit easier for you to understand it. Uh, but just to add up to what you just said is the fact that sometimes when you're looking at the same code over and over again, like there's, you block oh, some absolutely. answers, right? Some answers that when somebody else looks at the code, they tell you, why don't you do it this other way? And usually just because of that, like, um, that also helps learn for uh, about other possibilities that you might not have even thought about because you're thinking about one solution. Yeah, and also there's, you know, we have a video where there's 17 different ways to automate programs with AutoHockey. There's more than that. But then there's also, that's just the different tools you can use. But then in any given solution, there's different approaches on how to solve that problem, right? And that's where when you have someone else looking at your code, someone that's more advanced than you are, they can really help you understand the value of functions or classes or loops or whatever, right? By structuring it in a different way. And that's one of the things like really having these sessions can really help you grow like crazy when, I, when <laughs> someone's walking you through it. We had a call. I don't know if it was just exactly today or yesterday. I, I think it was today that the guy was asking me, okay, so I just want to not have to copy this code and paste it here. I just want to always call the same thing. And I said, like, you're yep. basically talking about a function. This is what a function right. is. Right. And as, as soon as he saw it in his code, he was like, oh, now I get it. Right. So it was like, yeah, you have the question um, and you are actually manually doing the thing in your script. I could just point at it and say, hey, that's just a function. That's what it does. And that's exactly what it's for. It would click right away. Like you would definitely say, hey, oh, now I get it. Another thing that we decided is something really good is the fact uh, that sometimes when you're starting, you don't have a lot of examples of code out there. So if we provide you with a bunch of, you know, starter pack scripts that you could use to actually see kind of like an example of what a hotkey can do, uh, it, it is actually also a very good value. We have a, how many scripts? We have a few. We have already kind of like 10 scripts in there just for the starter pack. pack right. That, yeah, it's just for the starting Park, which you can either use for yourself because they're very useful tools. We, have, we use a lot of them in our day-to-day -day life as well. But not only that, if you want to see, hey, how do I do that? Well, you have the script right there. You can just open it and read it. And if you don't have, if you don't understand how it, how that really works, you can just give us a, 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 ask us a question and we'll be more than happy to assist you with that too. Yeah, so part of the what we we provide are two different sets of tools, right? Yeah. Some of them is for working on tools on your scripts and in like your auto hotkey editor switcher, right? Or the hotkey string lookup tool um, or the inspection tool, right? To see if it, there's any, you know, uh, nefarious stuff going on. Then there's our in overall inspection tools of when you're trying to examine, like we've altered the spy, Windows spy, right, Windows spy yeah. to be a custom version, which is just a little more, we found it to be a little more helpful stuff. So there's things that will help you to just work a little faster, right? right? So those are two different things that we offer in this. Um, and it's just part of it. You also get um, two auto hockey books from Jack Dunning. That's yeah, that's right. And then not only that, I, when I said that um, you could ask us some questions, what we what I meant by that is that now you have access for one month uh, right. for the for the hero group. We, we have a Telegram group in which you can ask, you know, we're usually there answering and, the whole community actually answers the questions. Um, and if 
you see something, you like it, but you don't understand it, you can just jump into the chat and just type a question and we're more than happy to try to guide you in the right direction with it too. Yeah, and, and to follow up with that, we also have calls three hours a week where they're um, two hours after the live Friday call, which anybody can join that's on shared on Zoom, uh, excuse me, on YouTube. Calls with the hero group are not streamed to YouTube. So it's much easier to share privileged information because it's a small group of people that we're not out there sharing it with everybody in the world. So when you share your desktop, it's not nearly as both scary and frightful that someone's going to look at what you have there and, you know, go run and tell your boss or, or whatever. Right. Exactly. But, but yeah, that's three hours a week. So for a month you have access to that as well, which is really cool. Right. Cause you, not only do you have the one hour on a one-on-one -on -one with the two of us walking through stuff, which is also recorded, you'll get a video on that, but you have these sessions for a month that you can join and get follow-up questions, which, which again, those are the hero group is really an incredible value. You can sign up for that. We do give you in this program a 25% discount as well. So you can use that towards the hero group or some other course or you know, whatever you want. <laughs> now, the, the other thing is that usually, okay, it's money. Maybe you don't want to spend that much money or whatever. Then we have something that is the guarantee that you would definitely get a very good value out of it. If not, what is it that we're going to do? Which is, I, I find it crazy, actually. That's, yeah, <laughs> when I first wrote it, is that you were like, you're doing what? So not only do you get your money back if you're not completely satisfied, but we're going to pay you however much you paid for the, the course. Right? <laughs> so it's a 200% money yeah. back guarantee. No, it's not even a 100%. It's like a 200% right. money back guarantee. And I was like, what? What <laughs> What did you say that? Yeah, it is because, you know, the people who've been through this, this yeah. uh, experience, they, the value they get is just mind boggling, right? And wow. and I know from experience, like the, the stuff that we're offering is so good that I'm willing to say, that's right. If you just say that you didn't understand it or it's not worth what you paid for it, then you get, not only do you get your money back, but you get double what you paid. Or, well, okay. excuse me, you get your money back and that and, one. <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. But actually the people who have worked with us, they, they have been so, so thrilled. And especially when they see their code Transform. I, I, we have one in the hero group that we started as something like, hey, I have this code. Let's see what it is. And he has been joining the calls every fr uh, every Saturday. And he's every single time getting better and better and better. And he has been like, oh, my God, well, this is so good. And I'm, I'm, I think it's a little bit addictive because the people join the sure. first time and then they, they don't want well to leave. <laughs> here's the thing. And, and Isaiah and I, but both of us have the same philosophy is – we're not trying to put people down on where they are, right? That's not, we've all been there, right? We all yeah. started off basically with auto hockey, sending mouse clicks and keystrokes, you know, and it's, it's not the worst thing in the world. However, there are far better, more reliable, faster, more robust approaches. And the vast majority of people that we see where they provide some code, they're using, they're imitating a human, right? And it's just a slower, it also breaks when you try using on multiple computers. Most of the approaches we take are more of an API approach, which are very robust. Uh, they, they are incredibly faster, off, you know, 100% faster many times over, uh, but much more reliable, and they work on multiple computers, which, and that's, this is what we do for a living, right? But um, getting you to, out of the mind box of Sending a keystroke, adding a two-second sleep, and then sending another keystroke or a mouse click, right? Again, we, we do do that at times, but it's very, very rare that we do that. Or we might have one sleep in a script somewhere, but it's really rare that we have 20 of them, you know, in a loop. One after the other. But yeah, then the right. problem is, the problem is not using that. The problem is using it all the time. So what right. we're trying to do is grab your script, reading it, and telling you how to think differently so that the next time that you're doing something like that, you have another tool of your, at your disposal to fix that same issue without having to use the hammer for, you know, trying to saw. <laughs> right. <laughs> so so it, you, 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 we're going to give you different tools so that the next time you see a different uh, situation, you think a little bit differently about it. And hopefully, and we have seen this already by experience, that's the reason why we're offering this, is that when we do that with your code, you learn way better because the example right. actually clicks. It's just like, oh, but that's what you mean, right? Right. Yeah. And, and a lot of people, again, you have this feeling that what you have, and it does, it works, but you're not leveling up, right? And that's where if you start... 
practicing and taking some of these other approaches, you really start leveling up. And then it becomes simpler and faster to write more scripts and automate more of what you're doing in a more robust way. So yeah. the thing is, we, we did a video a while back talking about how auto hockey isn't buggy, your code is buggy. <laughs> and that's with our code too, right? Like, but it just over time, you get better at doing stuff. And it's, it's an investment. It's an investment in yourself. There you go. So right now, if you can, if you just sign up now, like the only thing that you're doing with that is just letting us help you get your auto hotkey code into the next level. That's all we're doing. Right. So, uh, and remember, you have nothing to lose, right? So yeah, sign up um, and we'll take your automation to the next level. And there's nothing to lose because at the, you know, the bare minimum, you can make money off the deal, right? There you go. But uh, we have yet to have anybody ask for a refund, but it, uh, it's because we we offer an incredible amount of value for the price. Uh, and the price changes, but um, go ahead and check it out on the website. I'll put the URL up and uh, let us know. Sign up. Cheers. Bye.